everybody welcome back to my channel for the ones that don't know me my name is Desiree I do make budget videos here on YouTube which does include budget by paychecks cash envelopes stuff and plus more if you are new to my channel welcome and don't forget to hit that red subscribe button and that notification bell that way you would be notified anytime I upload a new video and if you're already subscribed to my channel thanks for coming back and in watching another one of my budget videos this time i'm just going to go over my budget for the entire month of april and after going over the entire month of april budget once i get paid i will break everything down by paycheck so stick around and stay tuned when it comes to the income I am budgeting for $2,950 once we take away 10% for tithing which is $280 I'll be left with $2,670 to take care of the bills and other expenses that I do have. I'm hoping everyone is having a great day so far it is Easter Sunday if you hung out with your family or your children or if you did a Easter egg hunt, let me know down below in the comments. At my job, since we're not in the office just yet, they had us to do a virtual Easter egg hunt for a $25 Grubhub coupon. So I'm really hoping that I'm able to win the coupon. That way I can save just a little bit of cash. But let's go ahead and get started with the bills. So for the first bill, we have rent. So for rent, we pay $745 a month. For afterpay, I believe I only owe $70. And then afterpay will be paid off. When it comes to AT&T, since we still have internet and I just switched my phone over to Straight Talk, which I did after the billing cycle. So we still get that same bill for $213. Now my bill was $10 more, but after I chatted with the representative, the representative told me that there was an error. So she credited the account $10. When it comes to NES, which is the electricity, that bill is 78. Now, last month it was a little high, which was $115 due to the snow that we had. But I'm really glad that this bill is lower now. When it comes to Walmart, I will pay the remainder of what I owe, which was $178 from when I had to get a new tire and an oil change. When it comes to straight talk, now this is just for my phone line only for my service card which would be or I'm hoping it would be $41 when it comes to discover I'm not really sure exactly how much this bill will be but I'm pretty sure it's going to be $97 which is not due just yet but I'll go ahead and get them paid off as well when it comes to State Farm, I am paying $162. Now, normally that bill would be $140, but since my mom ended up without life insurance, I'm really not sure what happened. We went ahead and got her some. So me, my mom, and my sister do split her amount three ways. So $20 would go towards her life insurance and the remainder will go towards my car insurance, which I do have a bundle with State Farm for car insurance, renter's insurance, and life insurance for myself. When it comes to saving, I'm really hoping that I would be able to save this amount. It would help me out tremendously. And that amount is $546 for the entire month of April. So 
hopefully I will be disciplined enough to save that full amount if not more when it comes to food I am budgeting for three hundred and twenty dollars when it comes to gas I will budget for fifty dollars and I'm hoping that I don't go over due to gas prices going back up for out of town I am budgeting for eighty dollars for personal, I am budgeting for 40. For health, I'm budgeting for $20. And when it comes to hair, I'm budgeting for $30. And when you add everything up, this entire amount here would equal to $2,950 with tights included. So I do hope everyone have a great Easter. I hope you enjoy your day with your children, your family, your friends. Hope you guys enjoy some good food. Thank you so much for watching. And don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe.